For the second part of tonight's show, we head back to Glastonbury to feature the music of the NRG. With their debut album, Warehouse Justice, selling over 100,000 copies in the UK alone, and their recent controversial single, Dr. Sunshine, giving them their highest chart entry so far, they are rapidly becoming one of the hottest new acts in the UK. With talk of a Hollywood soundtrack in the works and an upcoming European tour already sold out, we present to you, live on 101 FM, the NRG. Strange tales gather around the swelling mound of Glastonbury Tor in Somerset, the most magical spot in Britain. The alley rooms at the foot of the Tor hold the grave of the great King Arthur. This area is simply bumbling with myths and legends. Even in this scientific century, a Glastonbury magic still works. These ridges on the tour itself are nowadays claimed to be an ancient maze, a, a prehistoric holy way. And in the last 50 years, it's become widely believed that seen from above, a circle of land 10 miles in diameter around Glastonbury is shaped into colossal pictures of the Zodiac, Virgo, Leo, Pisces and the rest. Is there evidence to support these beliefs about the church being founded by Joseph of Arimathea? About a prehistoric zodiac? What is the truth behind the Glastonbury legend?
is the truth behind the Glastonbury legend.
Elephants and Boys. The teamwork we're watching represents one of many ways to build balance and poise, along with skill, strength, and general physical fitness. And there are other things to be gained from this sort of activity. And to find out what they are, let's meet some of the members of this group. This is Ernie Allen. Note the well-developed body. No surplus of soft fat. Here's Hal Thompson. Notice his alertness, his bright interest. And meet Jean Taylor. She's a living example of poise and confidence. Anyone in the acrobatics club could tell us a story of how much he has gained from it. But we'll concentrate on these three. Ernie. And Jean. And Hal. represents one of many ways to build balance and poise, along with skill, strength, and general physical fitness. And there are other things to be gained from this sort of activity. And to find out what they are.
I'm telling you, man, the fruit are talking to me. Can't you hear it? It's incredible. The oranges, the lemons, the grapefruit. I'm literally having a conversation with them right now.
heard her talking to me. Can't you hear it? California.
Join us next week when we bring you the upcoming Sheffield industrialists Randolph and Mortimer and their blistering live set from Reading 91.